All right, here's a quick uh, percent increase, decrease little formula. Uh, within 30 seconds, you can determine the percent increase or percent decrease of, of any quantity. And it's simply the percent increase uh, is equal to, or, or decrease is equal to the amount. What is the amount? Divided by uh, the original amount, how much it's increased or decreased, divided by the original amount times 100. Okay, let's take a look at an example. Uh, example number one. Um, the cost of a basket of groceries this month increased from $65.76 to $74.45. What was the percent increase in the cost of the groceries? All right, let's get our calculator in here. So I've got uh, $74.45. Let's put that in there, and we're going to subtract. Uh, let's see. We're going to subtract, what is it, uh, 65.76. And that's equal to um, 8.69. And using the formula, what we want to do here is divide that by the original amount. That's the amount that we started with, which was 65.76. So divided by 65.76 um, equals, okay, we get that decimal there. And that decimal we want to convert to a uh, percent, and what we're simply going to do is multiply by 100. Okay, so we're going to multiply by 100, and we get 13.214. So approximately that would be 13.2 percent. Okay, so that was an increase, percent increase. Same thing with percent decrease. Okay. Um, And what I want to do here is I'm going to, uh, to start with 13.755. I'm going to subtract. I'm always going to take the larger number and subtract the, uh, the smaller number. The words increase and decrease deal with whether it's uh, a negative or a positive. Um, and then I'm going to subtract 12, uh, 876, 12, 876 equals, uh, that's 879, uh, the difference in population, 879 people. And then we're going to divide that by the original amount. And the original amount was 13,755. And that's equal to 0 0.0639, multiply that by 100, it's a decimal, change it to a percent, and we wind up with 6.39%. So that's 6.39%. And that's it. Quick percent increase and decrease.